Welcome back from the break. Time for us to bring you sports. And Lawrence is here. Hi, Lawrence. Good morning. I am good. Come. Um, well, yesterday he didn't come and I had a chance to present the news and to celebrate my team beating uh, Liverpool. It would have been a good conversation. Uh, you remember the last uh, time I told you for, <laughs> for losing and then this time you won. So it would have been uh, quite a good conversation. But that's why you ran away. You knew I was going to take you off. The way I was into football. <laughs> anyway. So um, mm -hmm. today we are talking the Black Galaxies. Okay. No, they've not been to the Chan tournament for quite some time now. Mm -hmm. And then they are stepping up preparations ahead of facing Nigeria in the final round of qualifiers. Mm -hmm. So on Sunday, they will play um, Nigeria okay. uh, in, the fi in the first leg of the final round of qualifiers. However, before that, um, they were in Austria, okay. or they are in Austria as part of their preparations. They played the Qatar main team, Qatar main team um, last night, okay. where they lost 2-1. The team that Qatar is taking to the World Cup? Yes. Okay. So it's the main team. That's good, then. It, well, it, it was a 2-1 scoreline. You know, there's, there's this feeling that the Black Galaxies team is that bad. I feel oh. if they've been able to hold uh, or restrict the Qatar team to just a 2 1 scoreline, it was a fair performance. No, um, how, Qatar is not that top, oh, uh, if, top if, if you, team. If you follow the Qatar team mm -hmm. for, the last, for the last years or for the last two years, mm -hmm. you feel there's an improvement in the team. Or someone will say they are not a footballing country. But then exactly. right now, you, you can't identify any team as a footballing country because there are more surprises in the football game. Okay. So yesterday, um, Daniel Freire by near was on the score sheet for the Black Galaxies. That guy is really proving himself worthy for uh, Dubai, uh, 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 Qatar, uh, yeah, really. Yeah, for the World Cup. Yeah. I feel, and there's rumors that he, he's already been approached by foreign clubs, although okay. has, has are not willing to let him go. Mm. But then yesterday's performance um, shows that the Black Galaxies are obviously aiming to be at the Chan tournament mm. um, next year. They've not been there for some time now. Mm. Um, in the first round of qualifiers, you remember they beat Benin home and away mm. to advance to the next stage where they will face Nigeria. Nigeria's home, home team is quite a solid, a solid team. Mm. So it will take something extra for Ghana to qualify ahead of Nigeria. However, uh, Arnold Walker is, is not giving up on taking Ghana there. You know, he says yesterday his team could have held Qatar to a draw okay. or probably beat them, but then for the respect they have for them, it was like um, what what respect and good. and that's so, something he needs to speak to them yeah. about I, I, that I feel, don't show respect to any team i feel the fact that mm. they were told it's Qatar's main team okay you know you don't want to go into some of these fixtures um handing injuries to okay. these players okay. who will be playing okay. at the world cup so well. i thought it was it was quite a caution from the players but then an worker has has made it clear don't give respect you're mm. here to play the game you need to be direct, you need to be focused and then achieve your target. If you don't do that and show too much respect, your opponent takes advantage and then you are going down. Okay, yeah. all right, okay. So that's it. Glasson, our, our course, was on the team? Yeah, he was on the team. Okay. Um, yeah. Danlad Ibrahim was on the uh, team. Oh, yeah. Danlad is a, is a Kotoko goalkeeper, yes. right? Oh, yes. Solid. Mm, uh, well, but everybody knows that he's a solid Yesterday also the GFA released um, the fixtures for the Ghana Women's Premier League 2022-23 okay. um, season. Okay. So, yeah, that's has that's also out. Mm. And don't forget the main Premier League, the best part Premier League starts in two weeks' time. Okay. The transfer window is already closed. Yeah. Yeah, okay. All right then. But the Hazakas ladies will be coming back for uh, for what belong what is ours. Yeah, probably. Uh, claiming it from from our, is it what? Yeah, uh, I, I, I was the ladies, the Kumasi ladies who, who, who uh, won. I'm from the Chima. Yeah, that's what. Oh, I'm that's, that's the Chima. Yeah. Uh -huh. So they are playing their Wafu B qualifier second game today. No, oh, okay. Baisela from Nigeria. They, you remember they won their first game three zero. It was okay. quite a convincing performance. Mm. So they are hoping to um, beat the Nigerian side as well. That will give them six points. They stand uh, to progress to the next round of. Okay of the competition. And then if they are able to make the final, they could mm. represent Ghana, just like okay. Azakas did last yeah. year mm. in the, CAF, uh, mm. the second edition of the CAF Women's Championship. Okay. Well, we, we, we wish them all the best because, look, Azakas has done it. We want them to go and then do better than we did. Uh, um, Hopefully. And, and that's how we wrap up today's uh, bulletin. There's more news on myjoyonline.com. My name is Samuel Kojo Brace. Do enjoy the rest of our programs. Have a good morning.